Hey everyone, welcome to the channel. We're going to take out my cameo for a little spin here. Let's uh, go for a little rip and I'll show you a little bit about it. Underneath the hood we've got uh, the battery that was in it when I picked it up. It's probably at least 12 or 15 years old, somewhere in there. still works, so I'm going to leave that in there for the little bit that I drive it. Uh, a little bit dusty. Um, but when I did have to get it running, the compression tests were good, so we just threw some new uh, valve covers on it, clean it up a bit. Um, the headers that were in there dropped down very low, just to pass under the cross member uh, where the tranny sits. Maybe we'll change that out one of these days, but for now, uh, suits its purpose. Um, put a new intake manifold. The one that was on there before was a racing one. I don't know why that would have been on there. Um, so this one here is just a little more sensible. Um, but yeah, it's just a 350, probably from the 80s, uh, but it performs well, uh, as well as I need anyway. I'm not racing anybody. Installed some clear signal markers, polished up all the chrome. It needs a good wash right now, so it's not extra clean. All the chrome's in really good shape. I didn't feel there was any need to replace any of it. Looking pretty good. Did replace the uh, the locking gas cap, uh, the rubber shroud for that. Did replace uh, some of the handles and gaskets. Um, kept the same locks, the internals. They were still good. Did replace these plates. Um, I didn't like the paint finish that was on here. The paint's not that great as it's getting pretty old, but uh, I decided to vinyl wrap this uh, just to accent it a bit. And then with the upholstery shop I worked with, I had them wrap these inserts uh, and then came up with this scheme for, for the seats, which is close to original, a little different. Um, added the seat belts just recently. Uh, got some Dynamat uh, in the back to keep some of the the sound deadening, uh, what it should have been from factory. Um, it's dynamated underneath, at least for the seat part. I got to finish up the front. This still needs to be all cleaned up. Um, still a work in progress. I uh, had a floor shifter in it when I got it, so we just put a, a little better one in. It was almost touching the ground. This one's got a larger, longer handle, which is nice. Put in a factory looking radio. Uh, put a brand new wiring harness through the whole vehicle. Um, new gauge cluster. It was uh, new to me, but it was uh, a used one, so it is an original piece. It's not remanufactured. Um, put the original mirror back on. They used to have a, a glued one on the window, you can see, but it's scratched up right into the glass now. Um, all in all, though, a lot of fun. Definitely a head turner. Thank you for watching my video, my 56 Cameo. Uh, if you liked it, please hit like. If you want to subscribe, feel free. There'll be more videos to come soon. And uh, if you have any questions, let me know in the comments. See you later.